sun With a fish on your line Your day's just begun The world of American angler On lakes and on streams Now you're living the good life Catch the one of your dreams Hi, I'm Pat Trainer. This week on the American Angler, we're going to the mouth of the Sea of Cortez that forms one of the world's greatest natural fish traps. This gives Mazatlan its superb deep sea and light tackle fishing. We'll be going out on the Starfleet. They charter boats year round to take sports fishermen out after sailfish and giant marlin. Besides its stature in the world of commerce, Mazatlan is a major international resort. It is famed for its miles of white beaches, nightlife, restaurants, and great celebrations. Mazatlan is Mexico's largest Pacific Ocean seaport, catching and processing 37 million pounds of shrimp annually. We're here just in time for Carnival. Third only to Rio and New Orleans, it offers five fun days of dancing, music, parades, and beautiful fireworks. But we're here to catch sailfish, and big sailfish. So let's drop in and see the Mexican sportsman himself, Geronimo Jerkins. Geronimo! Pat, nice of you to drop in. Hey, how are you? You have a nice trip? You bet. Hey, it was great coming in here. Well, Pat, what's on your mind this time? Well, I kind of thought maybe my approach here might give you a little idea as to what kind of fishing I've got in mind. Sailfish. You got it. I'm ready. Well, I'll tell you, the fish are here. Are they? Yeah. Big ones? Good ones. Lots of them. Lots of them. Oh, great. Okay, you ready? You bet. I'll get you on snap, and we'll get going. Hey, let's go get them. Let's go, big guy. Stay with us. We'll be right back from Mazalan, Mexico, with some exciting sail fishing. You know, Pat, we have a technique here where we can catch billfish without a hook. Without a what? Without a hook. You don't catch fish without a hook. Sure can. You... This is called a mop. Okay, it's really, it's a silk cord. It was probably started being a shoelace at one time. Now, this technique is really a snare. It's not IGFA approved. It is really not very sporty because it's, it doesn't take us any, very much skill. But I want to show you this because it's a unique way of catching a fish and because the fish, you don't hurt it. A lot of times when you drop back, uh, they'll swallow a bait and you do a, a hook set, sometimes you get stomach hooked to fish and they, uh -huh. they end up dying. So this is a way uh, that you really don't hurt them. All you do is, is they have a serrated bill. See what you do is you tie this little cord. You're trailing it inside the bait. That's right. And what the fish does, the sailfish will come up and hit it. And as he hits it, he has serrated bill, it'll get caught in him. Mm -hmm. and, and he's stuck. And the more they thrash and try to get away, the more they're hooked, That's right. so to speak. Now, you know, it's really, it's not a sporty because he doesn't take any angler skill. The fish will hook himself. Mm -hmm. The only advantage of it is that you don't hurt the fish. You know, you just come, and normally at the end of their bill, you cut the, the cord, and the, the fish has no trauma. It never felt the hook. So when, you're, when you got him out on the bill, then he doesn't have the leverage against you that he would have if he was hooked in the mouth. That's mount. right. They're a lot easier to bring in, so too. You bring them in quicker, they're not as winded, that's and they're right. in better shape. Yeah. But it takes no skill. You know, that's the, that's the, it's not IGFA approved. It's really not a method that I would tell a lot of people to fish. It's something I would like to show you because it's different. Uh -huh. You know, the one thing is, a lot of times when people do drop backs on a fish, uh, you know, you can see, well, you can see a regular hook. Look at this. That's a. It's about a 14. Uh, no, it's, it's about, about a, a nine knot. It's a, it's a nine knot. Yeah. But the most important thing is that they do a drop back, and the fish will end up swallowing it. And then you have two of these big things stuck in their gut. Mm -hmm. So you end up killing a fish. Uh, no fish will die from this. Well, the real beauty in the sail is watching the fish jump anyway. Yeah. You're gonna you're gonna get a lot of jumps out of this that yeah. you might not get out of the hook rig, right? But this takes skill that doesn't. So there's, you know, yeah. this is something that I'm not gonna recommend, but I'd like to show you because sure. uh, it's something unique. 
Very I think good. what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna have Victor come down here and work with you, and I'm gonna, I'm gonna put you on to fish right. this time. I'm gonna okay. play captain. Sounds good. Okay. Get us on some fish. I'll do that, big boy. Okay. Let it go, fish. Let it go. No problem. Let it go. Let it go. Let it go. He's going. He's going. He's going. He's going. No problem. He got a long ways, Victor. Long ways. Long ways. It's a big sailfish. Big fish. Oh, he's out there. That fish got up five or six, seven times. <clears throat> got this fish on a mop. He had to let it. Let him run with it quite a way so he'd get good and tangled in it. We've got a lot of line out. Somebody wake up Geronimo! Hey, who you think put you on that fish? Oh, I didn't see you up there! Oh! You think the boat drives itself or what? It's okay, sir. How are you doing? It's okay. Got him going. Okay, senor. You let him run with it quite a while to get that mop on him good, right? You never use map on them for cage view fishing? Yeah, we caught one. Okay, today, now that one second. You yeah. tell me when I need more pressure for your reel. Probably need a little bit more. Okay. Give him a little bit more so we can okay, senor. put some on him. All right. You know the coin is more than a lock? The what? The coin for the lock. Coin. Oh, who threw the this, coin in? Yeah, this uh, John Davy. Brought us a fish, didn't it? See, they've been locked today. Look at this fish go! It's coming out, watch it! <laughs> watch it, look at run! It's gorgeous! Look at the color! Come on, sweetheart! Come on, fish, come on, fish, come on, come in! Yeah, another one, oh. another one, another, another fish one, jumping another back one, there, see going? Another one, look! Big sail jumping! Big sail fish, another one! Look! The senorita fish, right? Senorita fish, hey! She's shaking that head. Hey, senorita fish. Show yourself. You can feel her just shaking that head down in there. Still gaining on her. It's coming, it's coming, it's coming. I'm 50 yards only. No se ve el otro ahí. Or she's staying down now. She's making me work pretty hard for her. How big you think she is, Victor? For me? How big you think she is? Well, uh, maybe 118 pounds. Here she comes, I can yeah. see. It's coming, it's I coming. I can see the rag on her nose. It's a There's nice elf, a nice elfie. Look right it, here. Look it, look it. Pretty sailfish. Beautiful, beautiful sailfish. Coming alongside. <clears throat> ah, nice fish. Nice fish. Oh, she's strong. Very strong fish. All right. Okay, see you got her? Bring her in here and let's have a look at her. Okay, look at it. Beautiful senorita. Ah, oh, nice fish. Pretty fish. Yeah, 
Yeah. This mop doesn't yeah, doesn't hurt the fish at all, right? All right. She'll get rid of this real quick. Yes, sir. She'll be back swimming, doing her thing. Be easy with her and let her get her breath a little bit. Please now. And there she goes. Bye. Stay with us. There's more to come on the American Angler. How many miles off the shore are we now? About from Mazlan. 28 miles now. About 28 miles 28 out? Miles, 28 miles now. This water out here is just absolutely beautiful. That's a beautiful water. Nice, clear, blue, lots of food for uh, fly fish and squid. This area around Mazlan is just loaded with fish, That's isn't right. it? What's your best months down here? I like uh, June, July, and June, July, November. Well, it's real hot. Oh, no, it's not hot. It's nice weather. Is it? It's, it's hot in the September too. It's very hot. It's not better. Same weather. Oh, this is this is great. You're right. More more selfish. June, and July, lots of sales. Oh, right here, right here. Yeah. We got one. We got one. What one, one? See another one. Right here. Yeah. yeah. See, see his fin up right here? Oh, yeah. Is that a sail? Yeah. Sailfish. Big sail. Okay. John, get out of there. Big sail. Come right across the front of the boat. Richard, se aventó hasta yo. We ran that bait right in front of his nose. Circling the fish right now, trying to get a bait right in front of this fish. It looks like a big sail. that bait right in front of his nose. There he comes. He's coming up on it. There's a, there's a strike. Okay. Get, get that clicker off. Don't, don't try to set the hook. There's no hook. Don't, don't set I the hook. I cannot set the hook. We don't have a hook. I know. You don't. This one's on the mop. That's right. Oh, look at her go. There she goes! Working. Okay, get the clicker off. There you go. There she goes! Ah, oh, that's a pretty fish! Look at her go! There's a jump! Uh, there's another one with it. Another one! Yes, yeah, she likes to fight him. There you go. There we go. Pull up. Okay, yes. That's why right. I, I don't want it to jump until we get him. He's coming up. Okay. Okay, you, you don't put as, put as little pressure as you can on him. And just, just go up very slowly and come down very slowly. Okay, what well we caught, he's on, he's on a thing called a mop, okay? Uh huh. This is what I was telling you about earlier. You know, where we don't have a hook on there, what we did is just put a nylon cord. Right, I saw that. Is that now, it's not IGFA approved, okay? But really, that's not the important thing here. This is, a, I wanted to show you a different way in which they fish in Mexico. And it doesn't hurt the fish, you know, you never get a gut uh -huh. hook, you never get, you never get, it's easy to release. Do you see how, do you see how he came up and just hit the bait? Uh -huh. They're used, to, they're used, they're accustomed to knocking the fish, either, either killing it or just, or just knocking it unconscious, and then they come back and eat it. And that's what he did. And when he hit it, that, that nylon cord wrapped around his bill. I never did get a good look at him. 
He just came up right behind the boat. They're, they're not up on the surface, they're coming down from below. There you go. He just ran. This one is not jumping very much, so. He's kind of staying down. Yeah, he's, he's going to make you work for him. He's going to make you work. He has just not, he has not wanted, and when they stay down like that, you have a harder fight. Have you noticed? We haven't had much pressure on this fish. Yeah. He's just not jumping. There he is. There he is. Jesus, he never jumped. Okay, he's right here. Let, 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 let him go, let him go, let him go. Let him go? No. Okay, let, 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 yeah, let, let him free spool. See, now the big thing here is to make sure that they get the wind back. When we pull it, I'm gonna pull him up so you, so you get an idea of what he looks like, okay? And then we'll How many pounds are we dealing with? About a hundred. This one's small. Look at about a yeah. hundred pounds. Look. Pretty fish. Gorgeous fish. Whew. Is he nice? What we don't want to do is mistreat him, so let's let's watch him swim away. Straighten up, sweetheart. He will. There's a fish out there, Pierre. There he is! Hit it! Hit it! Hit it! There you go! Hit there it! There he goes! 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 He saw him! He's gone! Look at him go! Look at him go! Boy, he's peeling line! Look at him! Oh! Man, he's just gone! Look! There he goes! Beautiful fish, aren't they? Oh! Oh, we're not gaining on him! No. Oh, what a fish! Okay, move, put, add, uh, there you go, there you go. Now we got it going. Now you get it. Oh. Oh, look, look at him go up. Oh. Look at the He's coming up. See, see how they open it? That's fantastic. Look at the color. I thought fish was so gorgeous. When he got up out of the water and tail danced like that. Oh, is he strong. They really are. I mean, they're just oh. beautiful to watch. Oh. And sometimes we get groups, we get pots of maybe 50 fish together. I mean, they put up their, their fins and their, their balling bait. Just fantastic. Oh, he's strong. Oops, there he goes again. Okay, you did something very good. When he hit that, you let him, you gave him enough time to take the bait and turn Damn. before you hit him. That's something very important. You, when, when a fish hits and you have a natural bait, he'll take it in his mouth. You have to wait until he turns. You, remember, you saw him turn? Yeah. When he turns, you let him take it, and then you hit him. Yeah, he was, he was pulling the line out. And then you have to remember, whenever you're going to hit him, you did exactly right. You reel down, and you waited till the slack was out of it, yeah. and then the boat moved forward, and you hit at the same time. So you had the boat, as well as your strokes, helping to make set that hook. Oh, this fish is strong. How big do you think that fish is? He's a big one. He's well over. 110, 115? About that. I was hoping another selfish comes with me too. Oh man, is he fine. Okay, just move with him. Move over here. Yeah, move over. Here he comes. Yeah, use, use the side of the boat. Use the side of the boat. When you stand up, there you go, there you go. Lock them knees into it. Lock the knees and use the side of the boat for your for your support. He's coming around. There you go. Okay, oh, now, there he is. Look at go. the color in that fish. Okay. Now change they the angle of your stroke. Change the angle. There you go. Just that that will turn him out a little bit faster. Okay. The other way. Oh. There you go. Look at the color. What a beautiful fish. Okay. What a fish. Okay, here comes, okay, okay. move, comes move over to the right. You here comes a snap. Okay, move back, move back, move back. Move back okay. at her. Keep it, keep it going. Here she comes. Let me let me get my gloves on. I'm gonna want this. There she goes. Okay, just don't force it. She going down again. Yeah. That's just. Oh, we about had her. <laughs> you about had it. <laughs> Look at isn't she gorgeous? Here she comes, Geronimo. Okay. Get ready. Oh. Okay. Oh. Move back. Move back. Now you just move back. There she is. Okay. So All leave. Right. 
What a fish. Oh, look at the color in look that at fish. Look at her. Look at her. Man. It's gorgeous. Okay, okay. I'm going to bill her and let her go. Oh, what a fish. Okay, I got her. Got her? Yeah, yeah. Oh. Okay, the hook is off. She is so pretty. Okay, I'm going to swim her. Move, All right. Move, move her both forward. All right. Take her forward a little. Okay, she's, she's swimming. There she goes. There she, there goes. she goes. There she goes. Hey. Isn't that great? Thank you. Congratulations, Thank you. senor. Super fish, just a super fish. This, you know, it's just, just it's so a wonderful. Beautiful. It's a wonderful experience to have to come out here, see the fish, watch them dance for you. You know, we saw that sail up out there. That thing was ready to eat something. You see, you, do you see? Remember when we were when we were looking out? We could see all the little bait fish, yeah. all the little flying fish. Yeah. She was hurting them. And you saw them jump, and then they just jumped and hit right. and jumped again. We knew there was something there. Those were all flying fish. Those she were had. all flying fish. She was just hurting them up there. That's right. Then she'll go through and just slap them with her bill until she gets kills them uh -huh. or stuns them. Then she'll come back and eat them. <sighs> Man, I'm telling you, that fish wore me out. That was a great fish, Geronimo. Oh. Thanks a million. We'll be right back from Mazalan, Mexico. <laughs> Well, it was just a super fight out of that fish. That was a tremendous fish. What do you think, 115, 118 right along How about there? that? Boy, that was gorgeous. Yeah. gorgeous. And the most important thing, again, we released them. That you is... have got so many sailfish in here, it's just unbelievable. Yeah. And the most important, the, one of the, the most important things that we need to do is preserve the, the sailfish here. So we need to release them. People need to learn the conservation. And I'll tell you, it's something that we slowly are teaching everyone. Yeah. Well, that's great. That's great. This is super What do you think, from fishing. a bass fisherman, we're going to turn hey, to I can, I can do this. Believe me, I can do this. I'm Pat Trainer, and we'll see you next week on The American Angle.